And based on that spring game, beat out Brian Bennett. He actually started a few games last year for Oregon. Mariota drills one right up. The ailing with a knee, did not practice all week, but in the lineup here this afternoon. Mariota, the direct snap. Throwing right side, man open. Too tall for Dillard, a freshman playing corner. They really like the work that he has done this year. Faking the handoff play action, big tight end opened up into tennis. Brown right up the scene alone. Mariota, play action again, steps to his left, gunning right side toward the post, has a man open and driven out at about the two yard line. Opponents off the opening whistle with speed. Now that was easy. Oregon has scored. What a, what a nice drive, and I think this is exactly what they needed last week. Oh. Next week here at home, they take on Rich Rodriguez and the Arizona Wildcats. Mariota fakes the handoff, gunning far side and tumbling out of bounds. See them come out, keep their pads low, and take the fight to the defense. Scooting left side again. We do hold him to four yards on a, on a carry. We've done a nice job. Second and 11 now for Oregon. Mariota. High pass gathered in, and that's. Went outside. And then Stafford was able to be wide open in the middle. Pick up a nine on the play. Jumbo formation. And clear out the backfield. Mariota back to throw. The freshman getting up the seam and just off the fingertips. On the money, Farrell Brown could have taken that all the way to the house. Second and ten. Thomas is the lone man of the backfield. Fake the jet screen. Give to Thomas. Left side 50, 40. He's to the 30-yard line. He has space in front, turning the legs and into the end zone. Just like Wow, sometimes, Kevin, I can't do this any justice. Just sit back and watch and enjoy on your own. Nice block. 60 yards, really nothing to this offense here in Oregon. Under Kelly the last two years, they've averaged only 50 points a game at 500 yards. Astonishing numbers. And they have... Thomas in motion. Pass near side, high stepping 40. Across to the 30. Breaks an ankle, cutting back to the 10. Swerves to the 5. He's into the end zone. May have fumbled the ball to the back of the end zone. Recovered by a lineman. Well, he's not going to get credit for the touchdown, but again, the blocking on the outside. Will Murphy just springing DeAnthony Thomas. Open field tackling. Not a problem. Nobody is going to stop him in the open field. He makes people look silly. And they should all be very competitive. Not a lot of separation in the Pac-12 this season. Screen pass right side. This weekend, Arizona State throttling Illinois. The nice win that Arizona had over then, number 18, Oklahoma State. You'd have to say, yeah, the, the field is evening. And, of course, Jonathan Franklin leading the nation in rushing nearly 215 yards per carry. They'll give it to Barner again on the left side. And again, he is hammered. Now, Kenyon Barner has added a three-yard touchdown as well. And all is good here at Autzen Stadium in Eugene. Ducks have possession. Mariano looking to go long. He is knocked down. And and Marcus Edwards, seven and a half sacks last season. And one of the few times they're able to get to Mariota. He's had a clean pocket. All it is, execution-wise mm -hmm. on both sides of the ball, has been flawless. It's just the penalty so far in this game. Barner cuts back, pounds into a couple of defenders. Mm -hmm. Oregon third and 11. Mariota quickly back to throw, sets up a screen right side. This is Thomas behind blocks, tripped up, shoestring. This against a team like Oregon, the last thing you want is your guys to go down. Mariota looks left, steps out to his right, and that's where Tennessee Tech will meet him with four defenders in the beginning on a fourth and one for Oregon. Yeah, Tommy McBride over there on the right side, really doing a good job beating the block of Jake Fisher. It's beating their ears back right now. Mariota play action near side to Dungy. And he is driven out at about the six. Mariota. The handoff to Barner breaks out right side. One man to beat on the edge. Stumbles, gets to the 10, to the 5, and then it's on the 8th in the Pac-12 and rushing last year at nearly 78 a game. 
And then he'll push ahead across the five yard line. Kenya. If you give him a sliver, he's not as explosive as DeAnthony Thomas, but he's not a very far second. Mariano rolls, has a man in the end zone. And it's one of their favorite plays. Mariota fakes the run. Wills out to the left side there. Lairla fakes the block. Gets lost in the shuffle, and Mariota puts it right on him. 57 yards. He's that kind of guy. And he has carried for 59 yards and a touchdown as well today. Walk it off. Yeah, and Mariota, he just telegraphs. He's trying to get the ball to his tight end. He telegraphs the throw. And Howard Griffin, who was hurt on the drive previous, a little knee injury, comes back in the game, undercuts the route. Gets Father is Snoop Dogg, the rap artist who also sponsors the Football League in Los Angeles. <laughs> On the touchdown passes, did not get charged with an interception. Here's the handoff. It comes up the middle to the right side to Thomas. He spun around and asleep. Adam doesn't want to reveal too much to Arizona or the rest of the Pac-12, but you have to believe at some point. They'll have Bennett in there and some slot to the right. Barner in the backfield. Mariota to throw near side to the tight end. Oregon penalty here this afternoon. Ball tipped at the line of scrimmage and batted back for a conference opponent against uh, Arizona next weekend. Is it cause for concern? Here's Mariota back in the end zone. His own end zone sets up, leans forward, has a man wide open at the far sideline. Receiver, kind of a hybrid that really can develop into a downfield threat. Great job on the edge of the. And Mar Mariota with a nice pass. Great protection up front, gave him the time. Mariota sets up, avoids the rush, sprints out to the right, throwing on the run. And. Now they're calling it a first down. The chains haven't moved. Now they do move. Mariota will roll out, throws back near side. Here's Barter. Deeks left, moves right. And moves shy 50 points a game and 500 yards per contest. Mariota, middle screen. Jabs right, moves left us. Kenya penalties per ball game in the previous two. They've already picked up nine today here in the first half. Mariota back to throw. Angles this one far side. Knee yards and penalties. Mariota back to throw. They screen it right side. And try to pick his way. And Rashawn Vaughn. Vaughn is in as well. 6-2 senior. Here's Mariota back to throw. And again, they'll screen it right side. Trying to free a man. Getting down to about the 42-yard line. Game 215. Brett Hundley, 18th in passing efficiency for UCLA. Oregon goes back to work. Mariota throws far sideline. That is again been able to turn around so far. And they've got Oregon State next weekend. The Beavers have the bye this weekend. Here's Mariota. Play action. Backs up. He's going to call his own number. He'll run it. It gets down to about the 33 yards. Starts a pop. <laughs> yeah. Mariota flushed out. He'll roll out to his left. Head up and scanning. Hesitates and throws. Complete Mariota the thing that you have to remember when you're rushing a quarterback upfield shoulder Don't allow him to break contain Mariota back to throw as a man open at the five Touchdown Oregon He just doesn't allow you to hit him wide open right here the corner has to fall off of his man to make the play Gives him a little shimmy Highly suspect that he would kick to DeAnthony Thomas. I thought he was trying to give his punt cover team a, a good look before they start conference play. Mariota rolls out a jump pass up the middle, complete down deep into Tennessee Tech territory. The Eagles clear out the middle and Mariota puts it on him. Mariota fakes the handoff, rolling out to his left. He's going to throw on the run and backpedaling into an jump. open middle of the field. That was good for 38 yards, Adam. Here's. Mariota handing off to Kenyon Barner, threads his way off to the right. On fourth down, Oregon sends Barner up the middle and except for a shoot. Between the left guard and the center, making a little seam there. And Barner. it doesn't take much to get in the secondary. Well, that's a nice job on that left. Barner doesn't have anywhere to run. 
Brings up second down, goal to goal. They sweep it right side. Barner again muscles his way down to about the three. Mm -hmm. Of the running backs. He can run inside, outside, wide receiver. He can carry the load. Mariota near side fakes them just over two minutes at Oregon on top, 42 to 7 on the Pac 12 networks. More from Encino, California. Fakes the handoff, rolls out, spots a seam, and runs into the end zone, which is what Oregon has averaged in the last two years under Chip Kelly. 49 7 the score here in the third. Bennett goes to work. Bennett fakes the handoff, rolls out, throws a bullet to the far side, and that one. Here's the handoff coming to Byron Marshall. Marshall breaks it out to the near side, just shy of the fifth. Rick, you know what? <laughs> hey, they're good looking athletes. 201 pounds on that frame, and he bounces off one man, turning his legs across. Thomas, how do you define him? Is he a back? Is he a wide receiver? And really, Kenyon Barner is the only full time running back. So it was key for a guy like Byron Marshall to come in here and. And be able to step in there when they need to. Bennett pass and Tennessee Tech will take it back. Yeah, bootleg sprint out action. And he throws rolling to his right. Really know what nowhere to throw it. Coverage was great on the man and underneath. James, it's great to come home and kick back and watch a full evening of one rewind after another. And what a great weekend it was last weekend. Oregon keeping it on the ground. Here. Good run so far by the youngster. Picks up 17 there and he'll get it again. Works it right side, gets a block down to the 46. That allows him to get in the secondary before he's touched. Bennett, the quarterback, hands off again. Slants left and then, as you know, no huddle offense for Oregon. They love to just get it and go. Bennett rolls out left. He's run out of territory and he... Downs. Rather than take the loss, I guess. Two by two for Oregon now with third and seven. Bennett flips it to the man coming out of the backfield. That pass was underthrown. I don't think it was caught. Incomplete. Cups in some cases you're playing third string. Here's Bennett now. Direct snap. Fakes the handoff. Flings it near side. Complete. To about the 47. Plays on both sides of the ball. A lot of different players. And so they're going to have to rely on depth to get them through this season. And that was one of their strengths of their team was their depth in this to their advantage giving Bennett some touches but also Byron Marshall who got the carry there and the carry again and he gets to the second level and is wrapped up and dropping out with these critical snaps who can they count on later in the season Bennett adjust you can see him check down the progression and finds a man Brian Bennett's best snap of the, in yep. the game as a passer went through his pro uh, progression saw who was open who was it and Total offense today for the Ducks, 557 yards. Bennett the handoff and a big game down to the five, and again it is doing a nice job gutting the inside of that Golden Eagle defense. Knight carries 103 yards, pump faking. Bennett changes directions into the end zone. Back position in this offense and down in the red zone, he's almost unstoppable. Watch him as he goes up over the top. You got to be careful, big guy, because. Now that's some dangerous stuff right there. It sure is. Seven plays. Landing somersault for his first touchdown, second touchdown of the game. And back to work they go. Uh, Marshall gives you a little bit of that uh, that thunder and lightning approach. Marshall is 200 pounds. Barner is at 192. And then of course. The Anthony Thomas will come out of the here against Arizona. Barner has a touchdown today as well. Negotiating the near side. By the way, we started the day 70 degrees and absolutely no win. Probably built for about 80 degrees today. Bennett on a keeper spins and got corkscrewed to the game last season. That was one of the best games of the season. But a little bit different Stanford team that we're watching right now. Obviously, Andrew Luck is the big story, has been the big story up there. Number 24, Arizona at home later against 
South Carolina State, their next opponent here in Eugene, breaking free near side. That is a sizable game. And breaks it down the field, almost a touchdown. Here's a handoff left side. That is Marshall bouncing outside. And a touchdown. Byron Marshall with his first touchdown of the afternoon. It goes over 120 yards. A pickup before there. Run now. Byron Marshall, 125 yards and a touchdown. Oregon 63, Tennessee Tech 14. Tackle Jake Fisher hustling downfield, picking it up for the score. Yeah, they go to work again. This looked like Ford up the middle for. Uh, I think it's a fashion statement. It's got to be so. that, huh? Yeah, that looks like it might be a Snoop Dogg special. <laughs> if there are two blemishes on this game for Oregon, the penalties is one, and the fact that the two turnovers that they had allowed Tennessee Tech their 14 points. And so that was a stat that. And as a civilian, you obviously playing at a very high level, an elite level for many, many years. You have a full understanding of that until you stand on the sidelines and realize how fast and big agile these guys are and just completely different animal and you got to watch out down there. No you really do. Well Dustin Haynes is into quarterback now for the Oregon Ducks. George Bennett came on in the third quarter did some good things ran for a couple of touchdowns. Mariota threw for four by the way. 